Hello, my beautiful Aries dragons. Welcome to your reading. It's your July bonus reading um, for 2021. So the energy for this reading is just sort of any time. So even if it's August and you're pulling up the reading because of the title, then it's meant for you at this time. Okay. So the bonuses are just sort of like, here's your reading. Okay. So, um, shall we get on with it? First of all, thank you very much for your support, your likes. Please be sure to like this video. I do appreciate it. And your subscribes. Um, I do appreciate that. So let's, get into your reading right away shall we so Aries 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 we have discontent and boredom crown chakra and solitude I feel like your uh, I I just heard this your fire has been put out you're just you've been extinguished right um, and I feel like you're you're not I just feel like you're, oh, hopefully this is a past note. You're not seeing what's there. You're in your head the wrong way. Okay. You're in your head. Um, and it's, it's, it's almost like you're dwelling on things. Um, boredom is never good. You've lost your passion. Okay, Aries, you guys are, um, you got, you're represented by the Emperor and the Major Arcana, and you're, um, you sort of just lost whatever makes you go, whatever gives you your drive, right? Yeah, it's like, because, um, there is no good bored Aries okay so you guys like being the ram it's like you're just like you might even just be going and you know hitting your head against things just for fun right like I feel like you might be a little bit destructive because you're so bored and really what the cards are telling you very clearly is that you need to um, go and um, meditate or have a have a talk with whatever energy you believe in, right? Just what, what, what's going on? Sometimes you just need to talk to the sky. If you don't believe in anything, you just need to open yourself up and talk to the sky. Yeah. Judgment. Okay. You're, 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 it's this inner calling. Okay. Oh, 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 oh my gosh. You're keeping yourself. Uh, yeah. Why is they? Okay. So you had a love situation go very wrong. I'm seeing that you may be getting divorced or you're leaving a long-term relationship if you were common law or even just a long-term relationship. You don't want to go. You're hanging on. Um, yeah, it was somebody who you thought was a soulmate. Okay. Um, wow, you have so much going on. You wanted, you were thinking that you wanted to go back but um, you just keep getting burnt and it's because you think that this option of getting a divorce or leaving it um, um, is um, too hard. But, oh my gosh, there's been a lot of pain. You have your lovers in reverse. You have the Hierophant in reverse, you have your Two of Cups in reverse, and then you have the Eight of Swords. You're putting yourself in this prison by not moving ahead out of it, and you're making the call to do this. Now, judgment has two meanings. Well, it has a bunch of meanings, but what else I'm getting from this is that you can make the judgment call to move from, is to move the judgment card from here to here. Okay, this is where you chose the past and this is where you can make the call to leave it behind and move into the future. Okay, let's see what else comes out. Guys, wow. First of all, personally, I'm sorry, yeah, 
you've been depressed, not, not, not for a long time, right? This is just a temporary depression, but you haven't been successful with um, trying to get out of this, right? This is this discontent and boredom. This is you not wanting to look out at things. You not wanting to see all the beautifulness that is out there for you. You see nothing but darkness. Oh, okay. Well, this is good. So your finances are going to be... Once you make the decision, okay, I was just told, move judgment card here. We're going to say that you make the right decision to move ahead out of this, okay? Because I feel like it's not going to be your call. Look at all the major arcana that are out here, okay? Look, we have the lovers, faith, right? And then you have the sun and judgment. Like, this is all, you're going to be pushed. You can help it or you can fight it, but you're going to be pushed, Okay. There's going to be some financial issues with it. Maybe that's why you're not doing here. Maybe, you know, divorce, lawyers, whatever. Maybe it's very, um, um, maybe it's a lot to take in with whatever you're going to be losing from this. It's, it's okay. Maybe you're going to be losing a way of life and it's going to feel unbalanced and unfair, especially because you're having to release this, but you will be releasing this three of swords. Okay. You're going to be releasing the pain, okay? And you're going to be moving on from the situation, okay? You need to go within. I feel like you're doing a lot of, um, you may be doing a lot of um, drinking to cope, maybe drugs, maybe sleeping around, maybe just anything you can to try to get rid of this pain you're staying right all in here and you keep trying to feel right you're trying to feel but not feel you're trying to feel something again something positive again but you're not actually doing what you need to to get to releasing the heartbreak which isn't going and doing any of that it's actually going and sitting with it and crying and working your way out of it and through it Okay. You can't go around it. You have to go through it and you have to, you have to just do what it does or else it's going to, yeah, look, there was a lot of fighting. There's a lot of battle that you've been through with this. Okay. To release this heartbreak, um, depending on where you are in the storyline. Okay. But yeah, and you are actually going to, and this is actually a really beautiful card, especially for you guys. And look at this at the bottom. That's good. And oh, that's good too. Okay, so um, you have the Page of Cups. Uh, not the Page of Cups. Oh my gosh, seriously? It's red. You have the Page of Wands. <laughs> but then you have the Ace of Wands. These are new beginnings. Now, why this is so significant for you is because you are fire. You are going to be finding your spark. You're going to be going and starting new, and you're going to be going and creating and creating and creating new beginnings, right? New power, new inspiration, right? You're going to become that free spirit and you're going to be completing. Well, not completing because we're always going through, but you've grown through one of your little, I call them notches or nodules in your tree of life and you're going to be moving ahead and you're going to be. So remember here how I said that your financially and stability is twisted upside down while you get rid of this? You're going to be moving away from it, okay? So you're going to be getting, uh, you're going to be recovering from it, okay? You will, okay? The five of coins in reverse is moving away and recovering from this energy. And this is beautiful, but you have to go through it. I'm so surprised you don't have a tower. So surprised you guys don't have a tower, okay? You have to go through it. Yeah, so much. But look at this. So you are fighting. Oh, and you are fighting, and you are fighting for your, uh, for your stability. Okay? Your judgment is going to be to, um, to persevere through it. 
and to 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 find your stability and to make it work okay that's the call you need to make that's what the divine is telling you whether you choose to do it or not well that's up to you right all of this is, is advice right if you don't do it it's not going to happen so yeah devil in reverse okay you're going to be breaking free from this you're going to be getting over this, guys. I'm actually getting a little teary right now. My nose is, you know, I don't know if you guys get this where your nose burns a little bit right before you cry. My nose is burning a little bit because this came out and now my eyes are watering. But this is really beautiful. Okay, so you will move on from this. You'll get over it, guys. Promise. Okay, Aries? Um, this is a beautiful reading. Okay, you, you'll, you'll be fine. You'll find your flame. You'll find your power. Okay, so you do find the people to help support you and help yourself get into some sort of meditation. There's so many ways of meditating. You can find mantras with specific meanings. Just listen to them, right? You can find um, subconscious reprogramming. There's tons of them on YouTube. Find those and listen to them, right? Um, find um, and, and play with them. Right? What, the things that you usually don't want are the ones that you need. Okay? Um, go find somebody who can help you, um, NLP, a counselor, somebody to talk to, somebody who actually is trained um, to help you through it or has been through a situation like this themselves. Okay? Friends can only help you from what experience they've had. Yeah, it's funny because right here when I said friends can only help you with the experience they've had, blindness came up. So I feel like you're not seeking the right help to help you out of this. You need to go and you need to put your Aries self. You need to get your ram in the right direction and you need to say, hey, listen, I, I need help out of this. Okay? And you need to you, you need to do your research and find the people, okay, who will help you through this. There are there's tons, okay. If it's something deep inside of you and it's your subconscious, you can find people hypnos hypnotherapists, um, people who work with um, NLP, neuro linguistic programming, right. If you need guidance, go seek out a counselor, right. Yeah. Um, blindness is the only one coming out. Come on, guys, give me another card. Forward. Let's go for forward. Outcome. Let's go for forward guidance. Okay, forward advice. Oh, okay. Uh, okay. Ugh. Inspiration, joy, and catharsis. Okay. So it's funny. Who just had catharsis? Another reading had catharsis. Um, I think inspiration and joy are definitely what you need to find again. You need to find your inspiration and find your joy. Somebody had catharsis, and I'm going to read that again for you guys too, actually. That's strange. I don't think I've ever had two of the same card come out. Catharsis. Okay, ready guys? Here we go. This is a healing card. It portends of steady and continued health improvements, health and financial situations evolving for the better whether it is a health situation or a ridding of oneself of negative emotion. A modest increase in money is possible. Illness possibly brought on by excess stress or sleep disorder. Not out of the woods yet. Stay on the course because you're going in the right direction. Okay, it talks about endurance and stability. Okay, so catharsis, beautiful card. Okay, my beautiful Aries, that is your reading. Stay on track, okay? Find what you need to help you grow, and you have to go through it, okay? I love you.